Right, this is from uh, Sue May, who says, Why are there so many goldfinches about? They're really beautiful, regular visitors to our feeders, etc, etc. Why are there so many about? I'll tell you, Sue, it's because people like you are feeding them. And I know this sounds like sort of we put it together as an ad, but this is absolutely true. Goldfinches have rocketed in numbers over the past few years. And that's all over the country. And it's generally accepted that it is because people are putting food out, especially for goldfinches. And the food they're putting out mainly is niger seed. It doesn't have to be niger seed. Funny enough, my goldfinches are a bit fussy and, and go for the sunflower seed. But I know a lot of people say, no, niger seed, get the goldfinches straight in. And um, it's interesting that it, it's, it's, it's the right size for a goldfinch, if you see what I mean. Because, uh, no, you don't see what I mean, but you will if I hold my hand up. That is meant to be the goldfinch's beak. <laughs> a little bit um, enlarged. And, but, it, but, but the thing is, is it's kind of sharp. It's got a sharp little beak compared with uh, the other finchy birds, the other seed eaters whose beak is more like that. And that's more like um, a sparrow's beak or a bunting's beak or a finch's beak or whatever. But the goldfinch, as I say, like that, a little bit sharper. And that is so that it can stick its beak inside thistles without getting the thistles in its eyes. And it also means that in the niger feeder, which has little holes, it can stick its beak in there, and it, more than any other bird, benefits from that seed. And happily, it's a perfect example. Feed them, they will come, they will flourish, and they are done.